Okay, everybody, welcome back to Sunflower Nursery. Um, this is the other shower box opening, which is a box opening without the baby. This one will be Al Seeds, because if you've seen the previous video, it was Aphrodite's. And this one will also have an extra bottle in it. Which is the other Aventi bottle that I got for Aphrodite. So, anyways, I went ahead and cut it open because, like I said in the other video, my tripod is not the best in the world. So, <laughs> I didn't want to take a chance on knocking it over. So, anyways, I went ahead and cut it open. And, of course, I got the address labels off of this one, too. But I have not opened it, so here we go. This, too, is from the same lady. And I'll probably do what I did in the last video. I'll remove the box and bring the presents up here and open them. But there's what it's packed like. She's got this one done in blue and yellow. And a little pink, which is fine got it packed good safe and sound I don't know why I bother trying to because we all know I'm gonna end up cutting it in the end so. all right I'm gonna go ahead and set this off to the side I'm gonna give you all maybe a little bit better look over this plastic there it is I'm gonna go ahead and set it off to the side and bring one pr little package out at a time. Possibly. I gotta rearrange some stuff over here. Let's start with this little yellow package here. Like I said, she put, you can tell she takes time and puts care in these product in wrapping this stuff. <clears throat> Sorry, you all. My throat's a little dry. I'm drinking some of the water. <laughs> Oh, look at this. This is a little fleece sleeper. It is newborn because I'll see does wear newborn in larger preemie size. And it's, it's like I said, it's fleece. It's like a teal blue, grayish teal blue. And it looks like we got a koala bear, a little tiger, a little bear, a little panda bear. It's cute. And there's what the back looks like. I showed her pictures of my babies. And I told her that I preferred clothes that I did not have to pull over their heads. So she did her very best to get me clothes that I did not have to pull over their heads. And here's this little package with a little pink ribbon. Oh, this is too cute. It's a one-piece romper. It's footless. It's got little gray, heather gray trim to it like a little sweatsuit. Little pockets, and these are real pockets, you all. <laughs> and it's got like a little leather sip. It's got little fleece lining right there. It's Carter's newborn. It's hunter green. It's got little polar bears all over it. And I, well, little bears. Some of them are brown. And this is like a hunter green color background. There's the back of it. He's going to look adorable in that. Dress him up in that. 
when I can. We got a lot of holidays coming up, so I'll dress him in the holiday stuff. Because as you all can see, I dressed him up for Halloween, dressed him and Aphrodite up for Halloween. And then November, she's got a Thanksgiving outfit. I haven't yet got him one, but if I don't find one, I'm sure I'll find something fall with pumpkins on it to put on him. Um, like I said in some of my other videos, I'm not big on anything that says little brother, little sister, mommy, daddy, aunt, uncle, grandma, grandpa. I just don't get into all that. And I really don't want my family to know about me having dolls because, yeah. My grandma would understand that's still alive because she's got dolls too. She actually got me into this back when I was younger. She had gotten me, uh, oh, I can't think right now. But she had gotten me a reborn baby doll. I can't think who the artist was. But anyways, and here's this little blue package with the pink ribbon. If I think about it, I'll let you all know. If I think about it when this video's done, I'll put it in the comments. I remember it started with an M, but I can't think of it right now. Oh, he's got the same little outfit. Well, ain't that cute? And his is in newborns too. So they can have a brother-sister day dress up. Oh, That would be so cute. And she got him the socks too. Match. So sweet. I don't keep hangers right now because I do not have the space to hang them up. I will go through all this, keep the tissue paper and throw away the hangers. If the tissue paper ain't ripped. So. And here's this other blue package with a pink bow. Oh, this is cute. This is another one piece. It is a sleeper. It's like that little, uh, it's Henley like. It's got the little ribs on it. Uh, it's got little zebras, little hippo, gator. This is so soft, you all. And there's the back of it. It's like a light bluish gray. It's got gray dots in it. And the animals are traced in black and they have gray highlights as well that is cute he's gonna look adorable in that as well i will eventually get me a newborn baby boy as well one that i can match with more And him and Elsie can share clothes. Oh, this sounds like the pacifiers. Here's this little blue package with the purple ribbon. Which I told her I do not put hats on Elsie because he's got horns. I know Aphrodite got hair bows, but I can be real careful with how I place the hair bows, but when it comes to putting hats on him, it's almost impossible. Oh, you all, I have liked sloths. My daughter, my oldest daughter got me into liking them. And I've looked for sloth stuff, and it seems like I'm always a dollar late and a day short on getting stuff with sloths on it. But there's a little sloth pacifier clip holder. So cute. He's made out of that real soft comfy furry stuff and 
And then we got this little army green organza bag. And it's got a little passy clip holder in it. She made this herself. It feels like it's all fish line. These are those gel beads that feel like teething rings. Turtles. And then that's got his name on it. I'll see. I was doing my babies with the wax stuff and that's the reason why she sent me that is because it it does work but some people got to tell them I read where some people said it pulled off the paint and stuff so now I just don't use passies because I have not magnetized them still I'm thinking about it but we'll see anyways there's a little nook pacifier it's cute it's got little star cutouts in it it's adorable. And then here's another little ma'am pacifier. It's got a little bear on it. That's cute. He doesn't have that. It looks a little big, but it's okay. Here's the one I, I ripped it a little bit. It did not, I promise you, she did not have it packed like this. But here is this little package, yellow package. The ripping is due to me picking it up, not her packing. My grip's not good. Sometimes my hands go numb. But anyway, oh. Well, he's got a little sloth lovey. He's going to love that. And it's got the blue satin in under there. And it's trimmed in satin on the outside. It's got the little mink feel to it. And it's got, this is a white with navy blue uh, figurines on it. It looks like plus signs and triangles and lines and anyways. He's got a little white face and a little fuzzy gray fleecy eyes and it's just cute he doesn't rattle or anything and it's made by cloud island sorry and then he's got this child of mine carter's little bear rattle it does rattle got a good grip on it Real cute. Little tan color. Oh, these are adorable, you all. And she gave him some teething rings. It's kind of... It's got a little gray koala bear. Little leaf. And then a sloth. So cute. And this is Itsy Ritzy. Itsy Keys. It's made out of soft til silicone. So cute. Use that for pictures too. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and open up the blanket, and then I've got two more after that. And this is the blanket. It's yellow with the blue ribbon on it. Oh, I am 
am going to have to send a picture to my oldest daughter because this has tacos on it, you all. My daughter, just a funny little backstory on her. She worked at Taco Bell while she was in high school because, yes, I am a mean mommy. I make my kids work as soon as they can join the, air, join the workforce. So, <laughs> anyways, she worked at Taco Bell. And um, let me tell you something. You would think somebody would get tired of the food, especially if they worked there. No, this child did not. And she worked there for three plus years. It was three or four. Can't remember. But anyways. <laughs> she ate there still. Oh my goodness. But anyways, she loves tacos. She still eats there to this day. Her man keeps telling her, it is not Mexican. <laughs> this is not real Mexican food. So, anyways, it's funny. <laughs> but anyways, this has got avocados on it. Little carrots and tacos. And then a little, uh... I say it's mushmelon slices and lime. Is what it looks like to me. But anyways, that's cute. I have a feeling my daughter will steal this if she has kids. So, but it's really soft. It's like that mink material on the outside. And then it's got the little fuzzy on the inside. And it's my, made by Chickpea. Chickpea. But it's cute. It's adorable. Probably won't get to keep it very long when she sees it. But that's okay. Okay. I mean, we're all used to our kids taking our things, right? Oh, and here's Alcine's personalized one that she made for him, you all. I tell you, this lady goes above and beyond. She made him, and it's newborn as well, child of mine. Look at that. It's got little yellow stars on it. And his name, Alcine. So cute. So cute. Look at that. And I got him some pants. I got a couple pair of pants that will go with that. Actually, he's got some star pants. Granted, they're not... They're tan color, but they'll still look cute. have to take pictures of... Alcide and Aphrodite in this. Now here's the bottles. See, she packed these very well as well. Now this is Aphrodite's other bottle that we have for her. And then this is the Mickey bottle that she put with the box. But remember you all, she only gives one bottle for the box unless you pay to get another one. She split the bottles up because I ordered two for Aphrodite and then the one that came in the box. She usually does a themed box. I told her I pretty much had all the Mickey and I'm sorry for the noise you all. I told her I pretty much had all the Mickey stuff you could possibly want for a boy. So I told her not to worry about making it themed. Um, like I said, my daughter, she likes Mickey Mouse, so she really, Mickey Mouse and Minnie Mouse, so she really wanted the Mickey Mouse and Minnie Mouse bottles. Oh, look at that. Look at that. It says, oh boy. That is cute. That is too cute. And this one is Aphrodite's other bottle. It's a vente. And it's got seahorses and anchors on it. Like I said, her formula is 
colored amazing. It looks like what I remember my daughter's formula looking like. Because I was very unfortunate. I do not have... I don't produce milk. So I could not breastfeed my kids. I tried. I tried and tried. My poor babies were going to die if I hadn't put them on formula. So... But anyways... All right, like I said, her box openings are amazing. I'm happy with them. Like I said, I'll remember try to remember to leave her information down below. Uh, so if you all would be interested in one, you could get in touch with her or even bottles. She does have a lot of bottles that she makes up. And she will put whatever you want in them. Um, and like I said, it's not gluggy looking like some people's are. I mean, and she seals it up really good. But anyways, I'm happy with it. Um, I'll leave it down in the in the thing so you all can uh, get in touch with her if you'd like to have your own box, baby shower box opening. Um, just a